Welcome to HalfArmMeals.com. I'm here with Dave Clancy of the Baker Street Station in Guelph, and he's going to show us how to make an original razzmatazz. Uh, what is it? Uh, it's a it's a raspberry based uh, cocktail. Excellent drink for uh, for the ladies, especially the ladies' drinks. The razzmatazz. It yeah, sounds, for sure. It sounds like it'd be something fun to whip up with your friends on a barbecue on deck, going for a pool, Definitely. To swim. We uh, we try to run like feature cocktails every month. We'll right. come up with three or four different ones. Uh, we've got a Tall Rocks glass, we've got some raspberry vodka, we've got some double chocolate vodka, um, which is really nice, uh, some raspberry puree, and some pomegranate cranberry blended juice. Well, there we have it. Okay, yeah. so double vodka looks like. Yeah, half of each. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> um, so we'll let's start with ice. Ice. Gonna do a half ounce of the raspberry vodka. You can do more if you'd like. <laughs> so it's half the it's a double chocolate. Yeah. Ooh, you actually smell the chocolate on that. Yeah, it's really, really strong chocolate smell. A little bit of raspberry puree. And some. It thickens it up there. Yep. And that'll thin it out. up a little bit. You got a razzmatazz. As simple as that. Yep. Nice Check and that. easy. Wow. Well, I guess uh, I'll have to give that a try. So I may not be a lady, but I can definitely appreciate the ladies' drinks. Wow, eh? Chocolate. The chocolate comes as a bit of an aftertaste. Yeah. It. Uh, I find that it tastes a bit like, uh, like Tartufo. Yeah, actually it does. So if you want to learn a bit more about how to make some interesting drinks, subscribe to our channel, check out some more of our videos, or download our app at halfourmeals.com.